Physics is all around us. From the way a ball flies through the air to how your phone works, it's the invisible language that dictates the grand ballet of the cosmos. But fear not, we're here to crack the physics code and break it down for you piece by piece. Classical mechanics, the granddaddy of them all. Let's start with the original gangster, classical mechanics. It lays the foundation for our understanding of how everyday objects move, like throwing a frisbee, how planets orbit the sun, or even the parts in your car engine. That's all classical mechanics in action. This theory is based on three fundamental laws of motion proposed by Sir Isaac Newton himself. The first law says an object at rest stays at rest, and an object in motion stays in motion, with constant velocity unless acted upon by an external force. Think of a bike coasting downhill. That's inertia in action. The second law talks about force, the push or pull that gets things moving. The more force you apply, the faster the acceleration. It's like stepping on the gas pedal in your car. Finally, the third law states that for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. So when you push on a wall, the wall pushes back on you with the same force, though it might not feel the same. Classical mechanics also throws in some bonus concepts like conservation of energy, which basically means energy can't be created or destroyed, just transformed. It's like recycling, but for energy. It's a powerful tool for understanding everything, from bouncing balls to the intricate dance of planets. Now, classical mechanics is fantastic for everyday stuff, but when we zoom in on the super tiny world of atoms or zoom out to explore objects moving at crazy speeds, where we're talking close to the speed of light, classical mechanics starts to show some cracks. That's where our next two superstars come in. Quantum mechanics and the theory of relativity, which we'll discuss later. Energy, the feel of everything. Before we delve into the quantum realm, let's talk about the fuel that keeps everything going. Energy. In physics, energy is like the universal currency. It's the ability to do work, and it comes in many flavors. You've got kinetic energy, the energy of motion. For example, a speeding race car. Then there's potential energy, stored energy due to position or configuration, like a stretched rubber band. There's also thermal energy, the heat that makes things jiggle, and let's not forget the powerhouses, electrical energy and chemical energy. These guys keep our lights on and our cars running. The coolest part? Energy can't be created or destroyed, just transformed from one form to another. It's like a cosmic game of hot potato, but way more awesome. Understanding energy is crucial for grasping various physical phenomena, from the inner workings of a cell to the mind-blowing power of nuclear reactions. It's the invisible thread that connects everything in the universe. Thermodynamics, the laws of the heat game. Speaking of heat, let's bring in thermodynamics, the science that studies heat, work, temperature, and energy. Basically, the laws of the heat game. It tells us how these things interact and what we can and can't do with them. Thermodynamics has three fundamental laws that govern the universe like cosmic rules. The first law says energy can neither be created nor destroyed, which we already know from our previous discussion. The total amount of energy already exists in an isolated system. Think of a closed box. Always stays constant. The second law is a bit trickier. It talks about entropy, which is the measure of disorder in a system. Basically, things tend to go from order to disorder over time. Imagine a clean and tidy room slowly turning messy over time. That's entropy in action. The second law states that entropy of an isolated system, not an equilibrium, a fancy way of saying balanced, will always increase over time. The third law deals with the concept of absolute zero, the coldest possible temperature. At this temperature, all atomic motion stops, and according to the law, the entropy of a system reaches its minimum value. It's like hitting the pause button on the universe's heat game. 
While absolute zero might be impossible to achieve in reality, understanding this concept is crucial for various fields, from designing efficient engines to explaining the fate of the universe, which, spoiler alert, involves ever-increasing entropy. Thermodynamics might seem abstract, but it has real-world applications everywhere. It helps us understand how refrigerators work, by transferring heat from the inside to the outside, why car engines need radiators to get rid of excess heat, and even the efficiency of power plants. It's the invisible hand behind many of the technologies that shape our world. Electromagnetism – Mastering the Magnetic Mojo Electromagnetism, the theory that explores the fascinating relationship between electricity and magnetism. It's like the ultimate power couple in the physics world. Imagine a magnet sticking to your fridge. That's electromagnetism in action. Here's the gist of it. Moving electric charges create magnetic fields. Think of a current flowing through a wire. It generates a magnetic field around it. And the plot thickens. Changing magnetic fields can induce an electric current and vice versa. It's a cosmic feedback loop of electric and magnetic forces playing tag. Electromagnetism is responsible for a whole lot of cool stuff in our everyday lives. It's the reason your phone charges, lights turn on, and even how motors and generators work. It's the invisible force behind countless technologies, from medical imaging such as MRI machines that use powerful magnets, to wireless communication like Wi-Fi that relies on electromagnetic waves. But electromagnetism isn't just about gadgets and gizmos, it's also a fundamental force in nature, governing the interaction between atoms and molecules. It's the reason salt dissolves in water and why chemical reactions happen. Understanding electromagnetism unlocks a whole new level of appreciation for the microscopic world. Nuclear Physics – Diving into the Atomic Nucleus this branch of physics explores the structure, properties, and transformations of atomic nuclei, those tiny, dense cores that pack most of the atom's mass. Imagine the atom as a solar system, with the nucleus being the sun and various planets, the electrons, whirling around it. The nucleus is made up of protons and neutrons, held together by the strong nuclear force, one of the four fundamental forces in the universe the others being gravity, electromagnetism, and the weak nuclear force. Now, some nuclei are unstable and can't hold it together forever. These radioactive nuclei undergo radioactive decay, releasing energy and particles like gamma rays, alpha particles, or beta particles. Let me tell you guys that nuclear physics has truly revolutionized our world. It's the science behind nuclear power plants, where controlled nuclear fission reactions release enormous amounts of energy. It's also used in medical imaging techniques like PET scans and radiation therapy for cancer treatment. Understanding nuclear physics has not only given us powerful tools, but also opened up a window to the fascinating world of nuclear reactions that power stars like our very own Sun. The Theory of Relativity – Warping Space and Time Now hold on to your hats because we're about to bend the very fabric of reality with relativity. This theory, developed by the brilliant Albert Einstein, revolutionized our understanding of space, time, mass, and energy. It comes in two parts – special relativity and general relativity. Special relativity deals with the bizarre behavior of things moving at superfast speeds close to the speed of light. Here, the laws of physics are the same for all observers in uniform motion relative to one another. But things get weird when time dilation comes into play. Moving clocks actually tick slower than stationary ones. And length contraction – objects in motion appear shorter in the direction they're moving. It's like the universe itself is playing tricks on us. Mind-bending, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Special relativity also introduces the famous equation E equals mc squared, which tells us mass and energy are interchangeable. This equation has massive implications, paving the way for understanding nuclear reactions and the development of the nuclear bomb. Then there's general relativity, which blows our minds even further. It explains gravity not as a force, but rather as a consequence of the curvature of space-time caused by the presence of mass or energy. 
Imagine a bowling ball placed on a trampoline. It creates a dip in the fabric, and that's how gravity works according to general relativity. This theory has mind-boggling predictions, like the existence of black holes and gravitational waves. Relativity might seem like something out of science fiction, but it's been rigorously tested and confirmed by experiments. It's a cornerstone of modern physics, with applications in fields like GPS technology and our understanding of the cosmos. Quantum Mechanics – The Weird World of the Very Small Finally, we reach the strange and wonderful world of quantum mechanics. Better strap in a bit more tightly because here, things get truly bizarre and may get out of control. Unlike the predictable world of classical mechanics, quantum mechanics deals with the behavior of nature at the atomic and subatomic levels. It's the rulebook for the quirky realm of electrons, photons, and other minuscule particles. Imagine a coin. In our everyday world, it can be heads or tails, but in the quantum world, things aren't so clear-cut. Here, particles can exist in a state called superposition, meaning they can be both heads and tails at the same time until you actually measure them. It's like the cosmic Schrodinger's cat situation, which also brings us to a paradox. To learn more, check out our video on paradoxes. This probabilistic nature of quantum mechanics means we can't predict the exact location or momentum of a particle, only the probability of finding it in a certain place or having a certain momentum. It's like trying to track down a mischievous gremlin. You can guess where it might be hiding, but you can't be sure until you catch it red-handed. Another mind-bender is wave-particle duality. Quantum particles can exhibit characteristics of both waves and particles, depending on the experiment. A single photon can act like a tiny ball, but it can also behave like a wave spreading out in space. It's as if reality is playing a cosmic game of hide-and-seek, blurring the lines between what we thought we knew. Getting further to the uncertainty principle, which states that there's a fundamental limit to how precisely we can know certain properties of a particle at the same time, the more precisely you know a particle's position, the less you can know about its momentum, and vice versa. It's like trying to hold on to smoke. The tighter you squeeze, the faster it slips away. So what's the point of this weird and wonderful world of quantum mechanics? Well, it might seem strange, but it underpins many of the technological wonders we take for granted today. Quantum mechanics is the foundation for lasers, transistors, and the very future of computing. Yes, the quantum computer. These machines harness the bizarre properties of the quantum world to solve problems that would take classical computers eons to crack. Trying to understand quantum mechanics might make your head spin, but it opens a door to a fascinating reality where the universe operates on a completely different set of rules. It's a reminder that there's still so much we don't know, and that the journey of scientific discovery is full of surprises. These theories are just the tip of the iceberg, but hopefully they've sparked your curiosity about the universe and the incredible physics that governs it. Physics is everywhere, so keep exploring, keep asking questions, and who knows, maybe you'll be the next Einstein to revolutionize our understanding of the universe. Thanks for joining our quirky crash course in Physics Explained.